Jamaica. Unlike any other for its creativity with a vibrant musical genre that birthed the reggae music. Their motto is out of many one people. From their delicious national dish ackee and salt fish to the spicy jerk chicken, from poetic literatures to having the fastest sprinters in the world. Traveling to Jamaica is always a fun experience, but it can get overwhelming. So in this video, I will be listing out the must go to spots in Jamaica. 1. First on the list, the famous Duns River Falls near Ocho Rios. This falls standing at 55 cm, 180 feet high, 180 meters, 597 feet long. A waterfall that empties into the sea, yet gentle enough to climb up, while feeling the refreshing coolness of the waterfall fall on your skin. In addition to make it even better, you can just relax at the beautiful white sandy beach at the base of the waterfall. It's no wonder they get thousands of travelers each year. Two. Second on the list is Blue Lagoon. Captured in a 1990 movie with the name, the Blue Lagoon is one of Jamaica's most beautiful spots. 55 meters deep, 180 feet, there also seem to be extinct volcanoes surrounded by greenery. If you like waterfalls, I suggest visit the eastern part of Port Antonio. There are four of them. The coolest of the pack is Reach Falls, with its underwater caves. A heart-shaped jacuzzi, where smaller waterfalls have carved out a heart-shaped space for sitting. while the cascade massage your shoulders. With mountain views and nature, water splashes over limestone tiers from one colored pool into the next. It's possible to walk and swim your way up to the edge of the falls by a marked jungle path, some way below the main. Three. Third on the list is Portland, which has the view of Blue Mountain Peak perfect for hikers who don't mind getting dirty. Portland Parish has Jamaica's longest coastline, more than 75 caves, and a lot of tropical vegetation, also including banana, coconut and breadfruit trees, the highest of the highlights, rising to more than 2,000, 255 meters, 7,398 feet. This parish has a lot in store for you. 4. Montego Bay is the tourism center of Jamaica and is the second busiest cruise ship stop on the island aside from Ocho Rios. It is also known for having great golfing opportunities, good beaches, diving and top-notch restaurants. A few good spots are Rick's Cafe, Discovery Bay Beach, Blue Hole, and much more. 5. Not just blessed with some of the most beautiful scenery in Fair world, Negril is a hub of all night activity. Be sure you see the island on horseback, keeping enough energy to dance the night away. Not only does Negril have some of the most amazing beaches in the world, but also the best parties. Six. Port Royal famous for pirates back in the 17th century. Port Royal was the nerve center or base of the numerous swashbuckling scoundrels, which plundered the high seas, 
of the more famous pirates you would hear to be associated with Port Royal are Sir Henry Morgan, Calico Jack and Blackbird Teach. Port Royal in Jamaica was known as the wickedest city on earth at its highest peak in the 17th century. The city was bustling with pirates and traders who ran rampant in the glorious town. If you like historical adventure and pirates, I definitely recommend adding Port Royal to your checklist. 7. St. Thomas, in the past known as St. Thomas in the East, is a suburban parish situated at the southeastern end of Jamaica, within the county of Surrey. The birthplace of Paul Bogle, designated in 1969 as one of Jamaica's national heroes. There are three main rivers in St. Thomas, the Yollas, Morant, and Planton Garden, flowing down through plains used to cultivate sugarcane and bananas. In addition to sugarcane and bananas, St. Thomas has an active dairy industry based at Surge Island. The people are friendly in St. Thomas and welcoming with the beautiful rivers, waterfalls and delicious refreshing drinks. 8. St. Thomas is a must-go to destination in Jamaica. Whether by yourself with a private certified taxi guide or with family and friends, you can still have fun. Eight. Last but certainly not least we have for the reggae lovers, Bob Marley Museum. This is the stop that tops almost everyone's list, is the Bob Marley Museum in Kingston. The rooms have been kept as they were when the legendary reggae artists lived there. Going down memory lane, looking at his recording studio, favorite clothing, gold and platinum records, and a lot more to explore. Bob Marley, Jamaican and a reggae icon everywhere. He was one of legends that put Jamaica on the map. The smooth reggae grooves of this beloved artist are adored throughout the world. As are most things Bob Marley branded, the timeless Bob Marley paved the way for younger artists. 